in this video I'm going to explain how to work with the block uh, meaning how to declare the block how to uh, define the block and how to call the block so uh, let's get started uh, with uh, the block declaration so let me uh, uh, declare it like this let me write a double uh, let me create the block as uh, uh, let it be our distance and time or rate and time let it be rate and time block uh, rate and uh, time or speed and time or anything you can write uh, and for this I'm taking suppose uh, double rate and double uh, time now the declaration is over this is the declaration for block declaration now let's define the block that is definition so it is like a rate and time rate and time equal to block double 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 rate rate and double time now let's go to the definition and I want to return a double value so let's return it return uh, there's rate and uh, time multiplication rate multiplied with time Rate multiplied with uh, time. Okay, so here I am returning it and it is expecting one semicolon. Okay, fine. So uh, the definition and the declaration is over. Let me call this block. And for calling, I can write caller, caller method. So for calling, let me uh, take a variable for uh, double. And uh, let it be or anything called uh, dx or uh, let it be dx uh, equal to uh, rate and time, rate and time, and passing the parameter as uh, rate is suppose uh, uh, 35 kilometer per hour, and uh, the time taken is one hour and 30 minutes. So let it be. Uh, 1.5 and let's see uh, how how much value it is returning so let me put an s log statement here and uh, I'll write rate and time rate and time uh, <coughs> the The distance or you can see the distance covered okay the distance distance covered distance covered uh, let it be percentile a and uh, DX okay uh, let's run the application and uh, let's see whether our own created block is working or not. So it is built successfully and I have created the block uh, here inside the gate method. That means if I tap on pass value, this uh, 
block will be executed I mean this method will be executed this method is nothing but a delegate method we have seen this uh, in our earlier videos so let me put a breakpoint here to bring the control uh, let me tap on pass value so the control came here that means uh, the same method is called let me move it and okay so it's right so let's check the logs and let's see our statement whatever we did wrote the statement is executed or not so here distance covered distance covered where is here distance covered is 52.50 that means our block has executed so this is how you can declare and define then call the block uh, well, if you want to create a block without any parameter, then uh, simple you can. Uh, what you can do is uh, simply remove uh, this part and write void here, and uh, you do not need to put anything here. You can suppose you want. Uh, a ns log or any other task to perform then you can do that hey I am from the rate and time block and here we are not passing anything we are not passing anything and uh, control reach not wide block so what is it expecting rate and time rate and time is a double it is expecting one double value so okay so return let me try for nine nine just for demonstration i'm doing this uh, because i we have uh, nothing in mind so uh, we perform the task and uh, as we have taken the double uh, return time i'm just uh, hard coding this if you do not want this you can put a void and you do not need to return anything as well and, and uh, this remove uh, the double and uh, we do not need this bracket as well so in this way we can uh, keep void parameter and void return type and uh, the same thing for this one as well so here we are not returning anything and here Simply remove for this person the left and you can see the count. Okay, fine. So let me remove this one as well. So if if I run this code, I can uh, simple simply execute uh, this statement inside this block. So let's see their execution statement for uh, this one. Let's uh tap on pass value and uh, the control came here let me move the control and you can see here hey I am from the rate and time block then we have not done any calculation other than this we are just uh, showing their statement with this NS log uh, statement okay fine so this is how you can uh, declare and define different kind of blocks uh, like uh, with parameter without parameter with return type and without return type i hope you enjoy this video if you do please like and subscribe this video and uh, thank you so much for watching you have a great day bye